Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Elle if you're new here and if you're not, thank you so much for coming back and hanging out with me today. So if you watched my videos before, you know that I love the Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale. I usually go nuts and do so many different hauls and I'll link a bunch below. I have a whole playlist. Such a good time to stock up on all of their smell goodness stuff. You can get such good deals and I just love to store hop but of course with the pandemic I was really nervous about going in the store. I did visit twice and then I have an online order um, so I'm gonna have to film another part of this so stay tuned. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out and I placed another order today because the sale ends in two days so I'm gonna try to get this up really quick and they finally had 75% off stuff online but I went on the first day which is when you can get the best deal in the store and uh, yeah I'm really behind on filming this I've been meaning to forever the sale started on December 26th the day after Christmas and I picked up a couple bags with the cute little duckies on them and I did manage to pick up some good 75% off stuff I know every store is gonna have a different selection so let me know in a comment down below what you managed to pick up because I love to talk to you guys so I'm just gonna share what I picked up and stay tuned for part two of that haul. This is the hugest receipt. I picked up so many good things and it's been a little bit. I should have filmed this right away. I'm kicking myself. I picked up a bunch of cool Christmas decorations, a bunch of different trees. I'll try to put in a picture here for my mom that were all 75% off. One was glass and lit up and one was like white and fuzzy and they were super cute. So I picked a bunch of those up for her. Those were a good deal. At the beginning of the sale, so they change up the sales within the sale. So in the beginning, certain body care scents were $4.95 each. So I picked up a scent I had always wanted to try. I still had not smelled it because it's hard to like smell it in the store. They don't have testers out. I picked up an Ultra Shea body cream in Sweet Whiskey. I love the packaging. I feel like it got to me. I love the pink. I love the gold and it's kind of like a retro. Looks like it was in their 20s collection. So the notes are golden amber, vanilla infused whiskey, and sweet apple blossom. It says elegance with a shot of edginess. Ooh, I love that. So I still have not smelled this. I'm like, whiskey, what is that gonna be? I kinda love sweeter body care scents. Ooh, that's nice. It's definitely, it kinda reminds me of like strong vanilla extract, like a syrupy, thick, sweet vanilla scent with a bit of fruitiness. I really like that. I do not need any more body care. I wasn't even going to shop the semi-annual sale because I've been trying to clean and declutter and minimize my Bath & Body Works collection a little bit, but the, the SAS is like a drug, I swear. Picked up a Lillian Green Tea body cream. I believe this was 75% off. And I did have a $10 off $40 coupon, which they usually send out for the semi-annual sale. So I use that in store. The notes here are Lily of the Valley, Green Tea, and White Amber. It's a nice clean fresh scent which is a little different for me they had a bunch of the aromatherapy like yoga collection 75 percent off so i got a bunch of different stuff and i picked up some more online in my order today um so this is the moisturizing body cream in zen garden made with mimosa pink pepper and langy lang to inspire peace and reflection so there are a bunch of these like spa aromatherapy scents and again it was kind of hard to pick up on them in store but again something neutrally would be nice. I never really smelled any of these when they came out. I feel like this collection kind of came and went really quickly. I didn't hear much about it. Oh that's nice. It's kind of like I have like the nighttime tea scent in a body cream and I really love it and it's almost gone and they don't have it right now. This almost seems like it could be a good replacement. So these are normally $15.50, the aromatherapy body creams instead of $14.50, which the other ones are. So it went to $3.61, which not bad at all for trying some new scents there. I picked up Stargazing Meditation Body Wash and Foam Bath from that same collection. Kind of pretty peaceful labels. I don't know. They just seemed like something relaxing I should try. So this one has bergamot, patchouli, and vetiver to inspire mindfulness and relaxation. Who doesn't need that? I love these aromatherapy, like the foam baths. They're different than the regular shower gels and they do get nice and frothy. So I go through these quicker than shower gels. Oh, that's nice. Kind of is a little more on the masculine side. Kind of has like a spiciness to it. 
but it's not terribly strong or offensive and I like it. It is very relaxing. So that will be a very nice bubble bath. Picked up a body cream and lemon drop martini, which is funky from this summer drinks collection i want to say was this called summer sip or something cute like that the notes are lemon zest sugar cane and sweet cream it has aloe shea butter and cocoa butter in this and i ordered a bunch from this collection over the summer online and i don't think i ever filmed that haul i've just been going nuts with bath and body works this year more so than usual i feel like because i'm just bored and ordering online so um let me know in a comment if you want to see a bunch of these hauls because yeah, I'm ready to film them and share with you guys because I have plenty sitting around. Oh, this is like a nice kind of sweet lemon scent. I don't really like lemon. Why did I get this? I think I got this for my mom because she loves lemon. And then the last things from that spa collection were a couple of essential oil mists. I love the packaging on these. They kind of look... I don't know, they, they look very trendy and minimalist and this one's kind of like planty looking, you know, looks very... Instagram. So I got stargazing meditation again, 5.3 ounce essential oil mist. And I guess these are replacing the pillow mists. It says use as an aromatic body mist in the shower or to freshen up your pillows and linens. So I guess it's like a body spray or a pillow mist, even though the pillow mists I think say don't use on your skin. So maybe they reformulated probably because they're gentler because there you have essential oils and then i picked up zen garden as well so i have a couple matching scents i think they had sunrise yoga was another scent but i guess i didn't pick up anything in that i feel like i ordered some online today there were four scents and i feel like one i didn't like very much and the other they didn't have in very many forms so i didn't pick those up but i don't know stay tuned turn on notifications with the bell you'll see the other ones in my order today online it was amazing foaming hand soaps were 75 percent off online which i feel like never happens my best friend told me to look and i did of course but in person i found a couple hand soap 75 percent off as well which is amazing i always stock up and usually use them for exchanges i don't love these are the gentle gel hand soaps i don't love these so I'll probably either give them away as gifts or use as an exchange because they are the new higher 750 price tag. So I'll swap it out for something I like better in the future. But this is fresh lemonade. The notes are lemon juice, lime, twist, and sugar crystals made without dyes and parabens. And the label's cute. I just really like the foaming soaps. So those were a nice score. This was 75% off. It was the last one, a body cream in pink velvet cupcake. Such interesting packaging i can't tell if i love or hate this design with the little swirls on it it's kind of retro this kind of snuck in and out very quickly as well i feel like and i always wanted to smell it and i feel like this is the kind of sweet scent i would really like i kept reading reviews online the notes are sparkling red berries whipped pink marshmallow which is right up my alley and sugared praline so like a berry marshmallow I feel like they always mix the sweet scents with a berry scent. And I'm like, no, just give me sweet vanilla. I'm trying to rub this in without getting it on my rings. I don't really take it off. Nice, sweet, girly scent. People were saying it smelled like the taffy scent from over the summer, which I picked up and I don't think I've ever used it, even though it sounded right up my alley. I just... I'm just switching up my scent so often these days just for pure entertainment. Let me know if you relate, but yeah, this is nice. That'll be nice out of the shower. Nice, light, fresh. It seems more like summery to me though. They had some of the holiday traditions scents 75% off. So I got some of the mini sprays, two in Vanilla Bean Noel and one in Twisted Peppermint. So these were a good deal. I figured these would be a cute little gift set and I already gave away one of my little peppermint sprays because they also had a bunch of the twisted peppermint lip gloss 75 percent off which is super cute so this was a good deal i think i made a gift set of like these and i just like to keep some around for emergency gifts or just little like stocking stuffers i feel like i was definitely supposed to give away a few things i've showed you already <laughs> for gifts and i just forgot so these are normally 850 peppermint such a nice scent to do in a lip gloss and i've never really tried their lip glosses since a long time ago when they had the co bigelow ones so oh and I got another one so these are cute and i picked up a bunch on their minis day too which i need to film a haul 
as well for okay i must have gotten three the twisted peppermint good deal why not i like both of those scents too but i already have a mini of vanilla bean noel from years ago it's taking me forever to get through this was 75 percent off normally 650 went to 151 a little travel size of the men's body care in forest which i don't think i've ever smelled it's a newer one it's their three-in-one hair face and body wash don't remember those being for the face Oh yeah, definitely like a woody spiced scent. Pretty strong. So that's like a cute little gift basket idea for one I'm building for someone. Good deal. Why not pick it up? This was normally $9.50 and it was 50% off. So it went to $4.44. They had a bunch of little gift sets, 50% off. Really good deals. And I could have gotten them for gifts, but I don't know. I mean, it's already after Christmas, but so many people I didn't exchange gifts with until afterwards or we were mailing late because of everything going on. And still I have a bunch of people I haven't given gifts to yet. So it would have been a good time to pick up stuff if you were out shopping. This has a cute little popper packaging and it's a hand cream in paraffin, hand nail and cuticle, and then a pocket back in sweet pea, which I really like. So I haven't decided I should probably keep this as a gift because it's just so cute, but I do like the sweet pea scent, so we'll see. And it just says, you're my favorite. Or whoever, because they're ready to go and adorable. So the wallflower plugins are $7.50 each for the refills. Weren't they just $6.50? What's happening? But they are $3.50 during the sale, so I went to $3.27. And I just picked up a few. I'm willing spring and summer to come faster. I'm like fully in springy fruity mode so i picked up two mango coconut cooler i remember people raving about this candle online years ago and they say it never comes back so i was excited to see a wallflower i love anything mango so this will be so good the notes are white rum sweet mandarin and fresh coconut so i feel like a little bit of like an edible coconut scent in this would be really good sometimes their coconut overdoes it but their mango coconut candle they came out with a few years ago is one of my all-time favorites picked up of course a mango mai tai too we're just gonna have a really mango-y kitchen and home starting pretty soon i'm gonna launch into spring fruity scents when do you guys switch over to that sort of stuff i feel like i don't know what to burn this month it's usually just really sweet i'm still burning like christmas cookie type scents but i started those early too so i'm kind of sick of them so let me know the notes are fresh mango nectar exotic jasmine and sun-kissed grapefruit so always a scent i really like guys this one was in the 350 i bet it went 75 percent off not long after but i got a sugared snickerdoodle that candle is one of my favorites this holiday season I don't know how I snoozed on it in the past because it's like a just strong, nice, sweet cookie dough scent. The notes are warm spices, creamy vanilla, and sugared musk. This is normally $14.50 and it went to $6.77. It was 50% off. They brought out a bunch of the True Blue Spa stuff for the semi-annual sale, which is a fun throwback if you've been shopping at Bath & Body Works for a while. Although, like a lot of people, I kind of wish they had this year round. I picked up the Supremely Smoothing Face Scrub because who doesn't love a face scrub? I have like two in my shower right now that are almost gone, so I actually need one. Wow, Elle buying something at Bath & Body Works that she actually needs, crazy. In apricot and white tea, little four ounce guy. Um, I feel like this stuff always feels really pricey, so I'm glad it was on sale. It says this lightly foaming scrub combines exfoliating crushed walnut shells and white tea to revive dull skin and leave it feeling invigorated and super smooth. And I had a walnut body scrub from them a while ago that I really liked. So high hopes for this, that it's kind of like a fine scrub. Kind of looks it. Sometimes if they're too chunky or coarse, it can be a little painful, so sure I'll be reviewing that and talking about it here on my channel. So certain candles were $11.95, so I went to $11.16 with a coupon. So depending on what coupons you had, you could have gotten a really good deal. I got a few, but only a few online as well that I need to show you in another video another time. I only picked up two in store, which was a good moment for me because I told myself I'm on an absolute candle no buy after candle day. I already have two videos up for that and my third box just came in so I just have a long list of things to film. <laughs> so get ready, get some snacks ready for me to upload all these. Ugh, I got some during the semi-annual sale. Now I'm definitely on a no buy, none, none, zilch, nada because I went nuts and 
need to burn through some. But I picked up Clementine Sherbet. I read about this online and saw it come out. It has a pretty cute like pop art little fruit heart packaging. And it's a little holographic. It's this cool lid. And it didn't seem like something I would like, but I smelled it through my mask. It's actually really nice. I think I'm gonna burn this tonight. It's like a creamsicle, you know? It's like, I mean, it's very creamy, vanilla-y. Notes are iced clementine, sugared citrus, and sweet vanilla. So the vanilla really comes through. And the other one I picked up was also one, well, this one people went nuts for online for a candle day. And of course it sold out. I couldn't find it anywhere in stores. I was beating myself up and it has really cool. Oh my God, I love the label here. So pretty and holographic. I kind of wish I had another one just to display as I almost dropped this. But I picked up cookies and cream milkshake. Oh, I just love it. And there's little like baby Oreos and there were mixed reviews online, but I smelled it in store and I actually did like it. I didn't think I would. The notes are chocolate cookie crumbles, vanilla bean ice cream and chocolate drizzle. And someone was sketchy and peeled off the label for the price tag. I wonder if someone bought it for Chris on candle day, got it as a Christmas present and returned it. Hmm. It's really nice. It just, it smells like a cookies and cream ice cream. Really good creamy chocolate cookie Oreo scent basically. So that one was nice and creamy and I was actually more excited about it than I thought I would be. And then what I'm probably most excited about, and I only knew it was 75% off from looking at someone's Instagram post because I follow a bunch of Bath & Body Works accounts on my Bath & Body Works account, which is Way Wicked Wax, where I review and talk about candles and bought their body care and all sorts of things that smell good. Um, so their little Bath & Body Works ornament is so cute and it's like $20. <laughs> so I never wanted to buy it, but it was on their 50% off table. And then I just had them scan it and it ended up being 75% off. So for five bucks, I think it's adorable for someone who's as addicted to that store and is such a collector like I am. So yeah, it didn't make it up on my tree this year, but I still have my baby tree up, so that will be added shortly. So that's what I got on day one. I went back to a different store, woo, five days later, just to see what they had because I like to see, you know, all the stores are different. And I, normally I would have gone to even more than two. So this is pretty good for me so far. Am I forgetting a trip? I've been pretty good actually. Um, so I went back and I just got some body care. I got some more trees for my mom. They had some more there. And then let's see, a bunch of 75% off body care. The only thing in this bag that wasn't 75% off is just a new pump hand sanitizer. So these are 550. We love this new size, am I right? You can tell they're going for all the springy stuff and doing kind of like a minimalist earthy trend. So this scent is cucumber and lily made with natural essential oils. They're trying to go more natural. So these pumps are nice. I think I'm just gonna keep this by my front door because I'm so glad they started making these again, but it's so many of these pumps are just in scents I don't like. So this one's very light, fresh, clean, very springy. I just wanted to mix it up. I really like it. Um, the only other one I've gotten that's a scent I really actually like and want to use a whole pump of is my warm vanilla sugar. So we're making progress on that. I picked up two of this a couple months ago during holiday. So I found a white jasmine body lotion, 75% off in the mini size, which is fine because, you know, the lotions take forever to use. So if I just wanna mix it up or take something with me on a road trip, this one will be nice. This one's nice and fresh and clean. And they finally started listing notes on the back. Finally, they never used to on the minis. It's creamy white jasmine, apple blossom, and white cedar wood. So good for spring. Just clean, fresh, a little like, definitely some fruitiness in there too, but nothing crazy. Feels sophisticated, but still kind of young picked up a country apple body cream i feel like this is the one they bring back sometimes one of the retired fragrances for um semi-annual sale the notes are macintosh apple apple blossom fresh muget sheer sunlight and orchard woods i think this might end up being a gift because it's not my favorite thing ever i did have it as one of my first ever bath and body work scents but i'm just so sick of it even though it's nostalgic oh and i picked up a body lotion too to my cute little gift set Picked up a cherry blossom fine fragrance mist. 
it was amazing to find fine fragrance mist 75 percent off i feel like those go really fast but things were going a little bit slower not as many people in stores and no scent notes here but it's different than japanese cherry blossom i don't like that one this one's a little bit more actually i can't really smell it but and i'm afraid to in case i don't like it we're gonna try that out later but i remember actually liking this one even though know, japanese cherry blossoms kind of a lot got a black raspberry vanilla body cream super exciting i have the spray in this and i like it it's kind of strong and a little too fruity so i only reach for it every once in a while but i don't know we're trying new things gang reinventing ourselves experimenting the notes are fresh raspberries vine ripened blackberries vanilla orchid creamy sandalwood and cashmere woods says it's an alluring scent inspired by vine ripened berries drenched in vanilla cream very nostalgic sort of scent like black raspberry ice cream so this is normally 14.50 ended up being 362 75 percent off i did get this i saw it online today for 50 percent off it's the gingham solid perfume which is so interesting so cute like a chubby little chapstick and i do like gingham oh I, I feel like I just keep saying the word fresh. Can you tell I'm really trying to manifest spring and warm weather here? I'm so tired of it being cold up here in New England. That's like a floral a kind of magnolia. Um, I don't know, but it's like a cool balm. I've never tried these. So if I ever travel again, you know, if it's ever safe, this would be nice to throw in a suitcase versus a liquid spray. Should I try? Should I go put it on my pulse points? Okay, it's not greasy, it has a tiny waxiness to it. It's like a Burt's Bees chapstick type of texture. Like a little waxy, not really greasy. Oh, it's so pretty and feminine and it just reminds me of spring and like Easter, just like really clean. Yeah, and it's pretty strong so far. So now I'm just going to smell like this all night long. It's pretty late, so hope that doesn't keep me up later but that's what i got so far only two candles are we proud i'm proud good job Elle. give this video a thumbs up so i know that you liked it thank you so much for watching with me today and hanging out with me and talking bath and body works our favorite topic right i want to know what you picked up at the semi-annual sale did you shop it at all did you go online what did you do let me know i want to talk to you guys let me know what videos you might be interested in seeing on my channel i do a lot of home fragrance, Bath & Body Works, bargain shopping hauls, some cruelty-free beauty, lifestyle, how to save money, and a lot of candles and wax and hauls and just fun, girly, lighthearted things. So come hang out, take a look at my other videos while you're here. It would mean so much to me. Subscribe to join our Glam Bam fam, and I will see you guys in my next video. Happy hauling. Three, two, one, bam!